with just seconds to spare. Okay. Yeah, um, he's doing that. There was an Iron Man mini that Fabro wrote that has still not come out like completely. Yeah, uh, that the he. One. Yeah, um, it's another astonishing book. The like, costume looks a lot like the, like the one we've been seeing. It looks on a Netflix. lot like the Ultimate costume. Yeah, and some someone like was assuming that it was going to be based in the movie universe, but they said no because it looks a lot like the movie one too. Well, the movie one looks a lot like the Ultimate one. Exactly. So. Yeah. Um. Let's see what what's this about? Does it say anything that contradicts the astonishing logo? Uh, not yet. This not is yet. The first announced astonishing book that does not immediately contradict the astonishing line. Well, since the Wolverine Spider Man one came out, that they didn't say anything about that at all. That's that's true. That storyline is not contradicted. That is, in fact, like a, just a fun story that is, that doesn't have anything to do with continuity. So I'm cool with that. Although I remember seeing a. Uh, an image somewhere recently for the astonishing Spider-Man Iron Man and it was called Carnage. Like it was clearly yeah, yeah, like I think that's just a Carnage mini now. They just changed it to Carnage. Which I I like that idea much more. Yeah, I they heard us, Eric. They somehow heard us and They're like, "Oh, you're right. This they they watched the news show and they were like, "Oh god, man, these guys are right. We totally dropped the ball on this one." One one intern in New York is watching yep. us right now and just somehow got the message. I did not read the next article. Uh, the Hickman or Fantastic Four thing? No, 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 the actual next article. Oh, well. You know, because the cause Hickman Fantastic Four thing doesn't tell us anything. It just says it, it's going to end big. It's going to end big! Uh, big! That'd be big! <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's the Doctor Who one, right? Is the one you're talking about? Yeah, with, with Doctor Who with Kryptonite. I somehow missed it. <laughs> That's the Sonic Screwdriver, Eric. No, that's kryptonite. Silence. Anyway, uh, okay. A moment here. I read this yesterday, and I don't remember. Hold on. Uh, oh, hold okay. on one second. I'm actually getting a phone call, so you fill in my dialogue now. Why, Duke? You are such a wonderful uh, host of news, and you should definitely do more. And I, you should be on my channel sometimes more often because you haven't been on it in months, and. Boy, howdy, doesn't Transformers 2 suck? It sucks so much. And, uh, um, Daniel Way raped Ghost Rider, and Jason Aaron's a bitch. And, and, um, did I forget to mention I have 2,000 subscribers? I don't think I have mentioned that. I've been hearing you the entire time. I know. <laughs> I was struggling too. I was like, I should just start saying random stuff. All right, so so, so Doctor New, so Doctor Who's gonna take out Superman in the new Doctor Who series. Can you hear me now? I can hear you. I'm just hearing this giant. That's that that that's my willpower crushing down around you. Is this, is this what I get for filling in your dialogue? Okay, so what they're doing is uh, since you know there's the new Doctor out now. IW, uh, they're canceling the one that has the 10th doctor in it and have the new one going with the 11th doctor. You're welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Um, it sounds like you're doing this from in the middle of a tornado, Eric. I, I'm sorry, I don't know how to fix that. Hold on, hold on. Is it better now? It is much better now. All right. So Bendis and Obe are going to create an all-ages adventure comic called Takayo. Woo! That's all I got. Uh, it's co. Let's see. The series is co-created with his daughter Olivia, and it's an all-ages icon book. That's it, which, which means it's creator owned. Um, yeah. it sounds interesting. Uh, just the idea of doing an all ages book. I like that idea. Um, yeah, I might get my sister to read it. I'm gonna. Yeah, I, 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 I was just thinking that like I might read it with my little brother. Um, yeah. I, I like the idea. Yeah, it looks cool. It's the let's see, who's the guy who does powers with Bendis? Oming. Oming's doing the art. Yeah, yeah. It looks cool. And then. Uh, uh, the next I, oh, uh, I, I, I saw this and said, "Oh my god, <laughs> really?" The, the 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 IDW crossover. Yes. This yeah, is it's crossing over all of these IDW licensed titles like GI Joe and Star Trek, Star Trek, Trek and Transformers and Ghostbusters. And here's my thing. 
as long as this isn't in continuity with those books, <laughs> it's going to be awesome. Like, I, so, like, if G.I. Joe can keep doing its G.I. Joe thing, that's fine. But if all of a sudden G.I. Joe has to, like, tie into Infestation, that's that's just crap. Uh, well, here's the thing. Here's how they're going to do it. So, they're going to have essentially... Like Zombies five, are robots! Yes! No, uh, there's going to there's gonna be five, like, two-issue minis. The first issue of Infestation, like, they're the bookends to this whole thing. Those are going to come out. Uh, it's going to go from January to April. And uh, there's going to be, you know, four, four series. Two, two. They're going to come out bi-weekly. And, yeah, this could be... This just sounds like the ultimate... What if we did the craziest thing we could think of? Yeah. Yeah. Combining, like... Technically, five things that we publish in comic form that have nothing to do with it. Well, well, uh, Transformers and GI Joe have crossed over before. Yeah. Um, I, I, otherwise, this is just madness. And I, I, I just can't wrap around my brain of like Ghostbusters is the only one that makes sense when fighting zombies. And, well, GI Joe could fight zombies. So with my Zombinator. Yeah, I mean, sillier things have happened to GI Joe. That's all I'm saying. Destro, summon the zombies. Oh no, the Starship Enterprise! <laughs> Alright, and so the final bit of news... Uh, it's a big collection of stuff. Uh, we're getting an Ultimate Captain America. Uh, it's, uh, I think it is a mini. It, it is, it, it's like the Ultimate Thor, which by the way is awesome. I did um, not read it, so I need to. It's it's awesome. Uh, I, I haven't done my, my poll videos yet for this week, but uh, it's awesome, that's all I'm going to say. Uh, it's being written by Jason Aaron, uh, which means I won't read it, and it's art by Ron, by Ron Garney. Oh, the guys uh, who did um, the, the um, Weapon X, I'm reading yeah. it. I love that book. I, he, he ruined Ghost Rider, so I just don't I, I understand, Eric, I understand. I'm not allowed to, to read anything. Uh, even, even though I really like Ultimate Captain America, and this actually sounds really cool, I'm not allowed to read it by principle. I'm sorry. Uh, the next thing is um, involving Marvel Cup one shot called Devastation Wave that's going to act as the coda for basically this giant cosmic story they've been doing. And uh, they haven't said anything about uh, Nova or Guardians of the Galaxy coming back. So, yeah. Well, they're moving on to Heroes for Hire, which is... Yeah, well, still, those guys could probably... Dude, they're writing like some of those in Infestation books, too. I forgot to mention that. Oh really? Yeah, they're writing the main Infestation, the and the Transformers one, and uh, uh, I think they're writing another one. No, they're just writing those, and then yeah, the other ones are done by other people. All right. Um, Ultimate Spider-Man is going to switch over to back to its original numbering at one fifty. Which I think I mentioned on here before. You were gone that week. I. Why even bother numbering it, renumbering it? If you're I kidding. know, I said, I and just, also. Uh, technically only 149. Yeah, yeah, I know if you actually add it up, there's, it's it's wrong. And also, there's going to be a, who's this person's name? Sarah Kelly will be joining it. Like, she'll be switching off with uh, David Wolf Wente. Yeah. Uh, and, and if this artwork here is hers, I, I actually kind of like this artwork. Um, uh, I think that's the Fuente. Yeah, yeah, I, I think so too. Because I was gonna say, if if it's her, it, it looks a lot like La Fuente, and I'd I'd be cool with that. But it works perfectly if it was the same. Yeah, and um, the last thing. Uh, yeah. Um, I guess we're getting a new Alias miniseries. Well, they I plan on I, it, but they're not really like r getting it out as soon as possible. Yeah, yeah, it, it's gonna be like a year from now. I still but, have the original series. I want to. I, I I do too. I I have I haven't gotten around to it, but I've heard it's good. So yeah, that's the news this week. I was I don't know how many parts this is because of that stupid we got cut, and I'm probably gonna have to put an intermission video in like I did one time with a random song and a picture or not. And uh, but yeah, that's all the news. Please, no one's doing this yet. Go to the forum post on geeksnotnerds.com. No one goes to that anymore. And post, post, talk. Tell Mark Millar to stop shooting me. Oh, and also, I guess, kind of slightly tied to some kind of news, I do intend to uh, bring my magazine out on the 13th. Yeah. Um, I'm tentatively saying the 13th because it's done, and I actually have a copy being shipped to me. Uh, but I, I want to get that copy before I officially like make it public, 
so I can, like, flip through it and make sure everything's cool, like, just the way it looks. Um, but I'm aiming for the 13th. It just depends on when my copy gets here, so I can flip through it and make sure it's cool. I, I, here's the thing. I rarely get to order stuff off the internet. I want to get it, and I'm, I'm making a deal with either my dad or my mom. Well, well, my dad. well uh, the, the thing that sucks uh, is, I'm, I'm, I'm going to cover this when I actually do a video, but the thing that sucks is that it ends up costing about uh, $10. Oh, because it's five ninety, and I'm like, that's reasonable because I got it as cheap as I possibly could, mm -hmm. and that's like three three ninety nine shipping. I was like, son of a bitch. Um, uh, however, you can download it for ninety nine cents. I'll, I, I don't like reading stuff on download. Yeah, I'll, yeah. I'll see. I, I want to get it, Derek. Trust me, I have yeah. to. I'm, I haven't added it. Yep. Um. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I said so that's coming out. So that's news. Yes, that's news. So that's all we got. That's um, the end of that chapter. Yep. Uh, we'll see you next week, everybody. Goodbye. Peace out. Get out of here.